Welcome to the Future Site, a Skyrise One's production facility, located here at Hawthorne Airport. It's the newest addition to our many locations in Southern California. This location has given us the opportunity to really lay out and display the past and the present of Skyrise One. You've probably seen in previous videos our daily flight testing in an aircraft called Luna. We'll visit that next. But this is what we're bringing into general aviation, SkyOS and our Skyrise One. The first thing you're going to notice about the Skyrise One is the lack of pedals, cyclic, and a collective. We've eliminated that all into one control stick, four access, simplified vehicle operations. What else you're going to see is the elimination of a traditional control panel with dozens of dials and knobs and analog gauges. We've condensed that with the help of SkyOS and our fly-by-wire technology into two simple touchscreens. That primary flight display indicates airspeed, your altitude above sea level, your altitude above ground, and heading all with synthetic vision behind you, assisting the pilot visually identifying where they're at and what environment they're currently located at. Down below, we have our multifunctional display. As most pilots know, Technology sometimes in aircraft will bring into a layers of pages where pilots will find themselves lost trying to obtain information. We've eliminated that. I can determine what chart I want. I can control the aircraft, handle my emergencies, as well as access my digital circuit breaker panel uh, with a single touch of my finger. Now let's go to our single four access control stick. If I want to turn left or right, I simply move the stick left or directly to the right. For pedal turns during hover operations, I simply twist the stick left or right to control the heading of the aircraft. If I want to speed up the aircraft, I simply advance the control stick forward. If I want to slow the aircraft, I simply bring it to the back. For climbs and descents, we have our thumb lever. So if I want to go ahead and climb, I simply raise up the thumb lever. If I want to descend, I bring down the thumb lever. This is the Skyrise One. We're initiating deliveries in 2025 and taking reservations via our website now. And next to us here at this facility is the original aircraft that we did daily flight testing in to develop the Skyrise One we have here. Let me take you over and show you. I'm now sitting in an aircraft Skyrise is affectionately referred to as Luna. First, I want to highlight that I'm sitting in the right seat. This has the traditional controls that most helicopters pilots are probably familiar with. I have my cyclic to guide the aircraft. I have pedals that controls the nose, and down here I have my power, which is referred to as the collective. So we incorporate traditional controls with what we're developing with our Skyrise technology, taking the most advanced levels in aviation for fly-by-wire and integrating into aircraft. So what you see here in the left side of this, of this integration is our original control stick. You also see our original touchscreen, giving our test pilots the ability to operate and test our fly-by-wire in the aircraft what you're seeing here is years of dedication and passion for some of the brightest and most talented people in aviation to take existing fly-by-wire technology that you'll see in modern aircraft and commercial aircraft and eliminate traditional controls and traditional control panels to deliver you the Skyrise One. Again, undoubtedly, the simplest, safest, most technologically advanced aircraft in general aviation.